After defining what radio halos are, this presentation will discuss the enigma of polonium radio halos, which are produced by three very short-lived polonium isotopes in the uranium-238 decay chain. They are most easily recognised in the black mica biotite alongside uranium-238 radio halos. Biotite is a ubiquitous mineral in many granites and metamorphic rocks, globally and at all levels in the geologic record. Yet the conventional millions of years time scale cannot explain the formation of the polonium radio halos. Indeed, one conventional geochronologist described them as a tiny mystery because the polonium isotopes that produce the radio halos have such fleeting existences with half-lives of only 3.1 minutes, 164 microseconds and 138 days. In contrast, a hydrothermal fluid flow model is being presented coupled with accelerated nuclear decay. It's been proposed and successfully explains the formation of polonium radio halos within a young Earth time scale, primarily during the year-long global flood cataclysm. This hydrothermal fluid flow model was used to make predictions, which have been successfully tested in several case studies, which will be reported, involving granites, metamorphics, metamorphic rocks, and even hydrothermal ore deposits. Hydrothermal fluids are produced as granites and metamorphic rocks crystallise and cool, but conventionally such processes require millions of years. Furthermore, it has been observationally determined that the radio halos can only form and survive below 150 degrees C, which is late in the cooling phase of these rocks. So therefore, survival argues against there being a heat problem with the accelerated nuclear decay required for their formation. Thus, the exceedingly rapid formation of these ubiquitous polonium radio halos in these crystalline rocks put severe time constraints on the crystallisation and cooling of granites and metamorphic rocks, such that they may each have formed with only, within only 7 to 10 days, which is compatible with the flood year. Even the major occurrence of polonium radio halos through the geologic record corresponds with the flood year. Thus, polonium radio halos demolished the claimed geologic ages.